Hi guys, Mark here on Creating Your Digital Life and today we're going to talk about uh, Facebook advertising. More specifically, what you can do to essentially draft up advertisements in a couple of minutes, which is going to be related to one of the blog posts that I'm going to share. And I'm also going to post a link to how you can actually set up an ad in specific, like walking through Facebook Business Manager and that kind of stuff. But more importantly, I wanted to share some insights in terms of what you need to watch out for if you plan to go on Facebook and let's just say you want to make more use out of it as opposed to just scrolling through posts and images and all that kind of stuff, you know, just to make it a bit more lucrative. So let's get into it. So essentially what you need to understand with Facebook advertising is that they want to create wholesome and useful content for every single individual and they have very strict policies when it comes to let's say trying to monetize any kind of uh, advertisement or any kind of business when it comes to that so first and foremost you never ever should mention anything related to money whether that's income whether that's replacing a job whether that's i don't know let's say you want to advertise um, a new investment strategy and you were talking about like the potential dividends and yields that it can uh, generate that's not going to be approved by facebook they are very very cautious about this so that's the first thing i wanted to touch base on the second thing is you have to be willing to well put it this way spend a bit more than uh, what your actual budget is the reason behind this is because Facebook actually does want to target as many people as possible based on the interest, the kind of topic you're targeting and all that kind of stuff. But in order to effectively reach them, there is a certain algorithm that determines how you can actually uh, get into their news feed and the highest bidder always gets a better chance. So therefore, let's say you want to reach people between the age of 15 and 30 when it comes to a certain candy that you want to sell, just from the top of my head. So let's say you would like to run this campaign for about seven days, but what you need to do is uh, set a budget, let's say, and they would suggest, I don't know, 15 pounds per day, which is like the average. So with 15 pounds per day, I would say, always go a bit above, because that gives you a better margin in terms of modifying and uh, ranking your ads based on the audience and the kind of messaging you're going to put out and that's going to give you a bit of an advantage now the last thing i wanted to talk about is what you can do in order to make the facebook ad a bit more appealing because chances are that videos obviously are the most effective way of reaching people however not everyone's going to click on the video itself and it's going to be muted so therefore, what is advisable to do is maybe create some kind of tagline, some kind of header that can catch their attention with a couple of words. Let's say if you are talking about people who are not able to progress in their career or with their life in general, then you can say, I don't know, stuck in a rut and use a couple of emojis because what Facebook does like quite a lot is using emojis as that uh, actually, I don't know what is the exact reason behind this, but it's basically a way to convey more attention and also to be able to stand out of the crowd. So in this way, people would be more willing to, let's say, look at the ad, click on the see more button and discover about the service that you have to offer. So in short, those are the tips and techniques I wanted to share. What I would also recommend is if you're trying to just put out an ad for, doesn't matter if it's Facebook or YouTube or any of the other big platforms, a software called Filmora and alternatively Filmora Pro, which is what I'm using, is quite ideal for putting these ads together. But I'm going to share a link about this in the description as well that you can go and check out on my website. But if you have any questions or if you have any comments to share, please feel free to do that. And uh, yeah, until the next video, take care and I hope you have a great day.